Okay, tonight I'm going to make honey garlic chicken. I have eight chicken thighs deboned uh, skin off and I just cut them up into bite-sized pieces. Um, you're gonna need salt, pepper, garlic, um, fish sauce, soy sauce, honey, and garlic, and just a fourth a cup of chicken broth. Before we put the chicken into the wok, you wanna put the salt, pepper, and the garlic on it, and then we're going to uh, sear it on both sides. And salt and pepper is just to taste and, oh! <laughs> <laughs> <New bowl. laughs> right, so we're back after uh, we washed all the pepper off because everybody makes mistakes and I use the wrong end of the pepper. So once you do that, you mix this all up and then you, we're gonna dump it in here. Here we have the chicken thighs, the salt, the pepper, and the garlic. And we're just coating all of it and we're going to uh, dump it into our wok. And we're just gonna brown it on both sides. And this is on medium high heat. So now that we've got our chicken browned, we're gonna add everything else. So I have about uh, two tablespoons of garlic. I'm gonna do a fourth, a fourth a cup of chicken stock. A fourth of a cup of soy sauce. I know these are not liquid measuring devices, but they work. And I'm gonna do a third cup of honey. And I might put a little extra honey just because you know, some of it stays in the measuring cup. And then when you put your fish sauce in, fish sauce is a unique taste, so just a couple of splashes does the trick. Ooh, that was almost pepper all over again. And then you mix it all up. And right now it's liquidy because of the soy sauce and the chicken broth and all that, so we wanna put it on simmer. And it's going to thicken up around the chicken and make it all glossy, so we're gonna do that. And while our chicken is simmering in our instant pot, we have a cup and a half of medium uh, grain rice. We're gonna put two cups, or no, a cup and three fourths water in. And put our lid on. We're actually gonna, I do have a rice uh, button, but I'm gonna actually use the manual button only for eight minutes and let it naturally release the tin and we'll have some sticky rice. So our chicken has, it's simmered for about 15 minutes so that it is now um, sticky from the honey and the garlic and our rice is finished as well. So I'm just gonna show you guys how I serve it at my house. Um, it's some sticky rice and I put a little bit of soy sauce on the rice just for a little bit of extra flavor. And then we put the chicken. And then we do chili garlic sauce, green onions, and a little bit of sesame seeds.